guys, welcome back to my channel, Michael Trey here. Today we are doing a review slash tutorial on this look right here using the brand new Kylie Jenner Naughty Palette from her Christmas collection. So if you want to see how we created this look, then please keep on watching. Alright, so let's go ahead and get on into the palette. So I haven't even really got to unbox it too, too much. So it comes in the really cute, you know, little Kylie packaging with her own little handwritten note. And the eye is like super cool, it like opens and closes. So really cute packaging, huge fan of that. She always goes above and beyond, I feel like, I'm making this stuff really, really cute. So taking out the Naughty palette, it is so pretty, oh my gosh. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It has like the dark green, a little bit of glitter. On the back here has the Kylie with all the manufacturing info and the silver, which is so, so, so cute. I should never ever be the one to open this So I need to pull it. Okay, finally. So taking out the palette. Oh my god. This is so cute, guys. So it's like the dark green background. It has almost like that velvet feel to it on the naughty words. It's just so beautifully done. And then the back is once again silver and it says Kylie on it and it has all the other shade names. Of all these, but she's are super, you know, obviously Christmassy um, shade name, which is really, really, really cute. So opening up the palette, oh, it is so, so pretty, guys. Oh, well, that's gonna have to cut out anyway. So opening up the palette, here it is, guys. It is absolutely gorgeous, to be honest. I love all the shades in here. They are so, so pretty. This is like obviously giving me all of it together. This whole line gives us Christmas vibe. This is just making me feel extra, extra Christmassy. So I'm excited we're gonna do a Christmas look with this. So I did also purchase the Nice palette as well as the Naughty palette. And I still have not got the Nice palette yet, which is kind of odd and weird. I wanted to be able to show both of them on camera, but I still don't have the other one. Um, which we ordered that one before this one, I want to say. And we went back and looked and like made sure everything went through, receipts and all, and it's all there. So, I have to show you the shipping, or so far, that is going a little weird with this palette, but I'm excited we finally get this one so we can work on it and, you know, play around with it. Um, but I'm still anxiously waiting for my nice palette, Kylie. Alright guys, so I went ahead and did my brows and my base off camera. I just applied a little bit of concealer all over, but that is all I've done so far. So, I'm thinking I obviously want to really play with, like, these reds, the green... Probably the silver, because the silver looks amazing and make it a Christmas look. So I think I'm going to start off with the shade Snowball. It is this white shade right here. And I'm going to apply that all over my lid. So first impressions dipping in. The pigment is picking up beautifully on this brush. And there is almost little to no fallout. Maybe just the tiniest bit, which isn't a big deal. That is extremely normal with these, you know, in any eyeshadow palette. So, um, no. So far this is doing really well. All right, so the white is down, and the white is looking gorgeous. It's white, you know. I don't. I when I when I see white, I want white, and that's what this is giving me. So that's awesome. So next thing I'm gonna dip into this shade called Xmas Kiss. It's like a orangey um, peach color, and I'm just gonna apply that in my transition, just using a fluffy brush. Same so with this color. Awesome pigment pickup, and very little fallout. So awesome. All right, and next I'm going to take the shade Unwrap Me. It is like the dark red, um, really dark red color. And I'm gonna use the exact same brush, but to keep it tighter in my crease right here and kind of blow it out into this orange a little bit. Again, same with this shade, very little fallout, good pickup, so I feel like all these shades are gonna be just the same. I'm real quickly just gonna apply just a little bit of tape on my outer V right here just to help chisel this out a little bit. Alright, next I'm going to take one of my Morphe M321 brushes and I'm going to take the shade Hot Toddy. It's like a really dark, rich brown and I'm just going to once again put this in my crease. We keep it really tight right here so we can almost cut this out and then we're going to put some silver right here. I'm going to start out by um, cutting out my lid with some concealer. I'm going to use my Morphe M432 brush in my NYX HD Studio. And I'm just going to put this right below where we added that color and all over the eyelid to give like an even more base for this silver to set on top of. Okay, 
look, you guys, the silver shade is down. That silver is called Snowflake, um, and it is absolutely stunning. I know the concealer, I'm sure, gave it a little bit of a better face for it to sit on, but once I did the concealer, there is literally not a drop of fallout. I'm, I shouldn't say a drop. There isn't any dust fallout from this eyeshadow that is right under my eye, which is so common with Shimmer Sage. They're a little chunkier, there's usually glitter in them, they're metallic, you know, they're a little bit rougher to work with. There is usually a little something, but I am like up close and I don't see anything. So that is phenomenal and the shade itself is beautiful. So A plus awesome for that. I'm going to go back in with this fluffy brush that I used for this red and just go ahead and blend out any harsh lines or anything that's there. Okay, I'm going to go in with a Morphe M321 brush. It's another one, just a clean one. And I'm going to go into the shade Emerald. Um, it is the dark emerald green, obviously. And I'm going to tuck this in my lower lash line and then use a little bit more of a fluffier brush to smoke it out a little bit. And then I'm going to take, go back into that snowflake shade that I use on my lid and just apply a little bit on my inner tear duct. Alright guys, so this is one eye pretty much complete. It is phenomenal. I have to say this formula is awesome. I have a few other Kylie Jenner palettes and they're the same. They're awesome. The pigmentation is great. The blendability is awesome and you really don't need to work too hard, you know, to just let it, it like it almost does its job for you. So it's really, really awesome. I'm loving the way it's looking so far. So I'm going to go ahead and catch up on this eye and we'll come back and finish with all the other good stuff. I'm going to take a little bit of this Ulta White Automatic Eyeliner and I'm just going to go ahead and run this in my lower lash line. Okay, so next let's move into lashes. I'm going to apply my normal Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. It is one of my favorites. And I'm going to apply these Ardell Studio FX Lashes. And I saw a few of you asking on what glue I like to use. So I use the Kiss Strip Adhesive with Aloe, and it's in the shade Black. Um, so it does come out black, it dries down black. Um, most of the white ones will dry down clear, but it's just, you know, it's a little convenient to see it nice and dark and how you want it to be. So I'm going to go ahead and apply all of this off camera and we'll come back and we'll finish with a little bit of highlighter and some lips. Okay, so we're back and the lashes are on. I'm loving the way they look. They have like a wispiness to them, just give us this drama, but it lets the eyes kind of do what they want. So I have this really um, thin packer brush. I'm going to take a little bit of Snowball. It's the white shade, but it's a matte shade, and I'm just going to apply it right under my brow to give it a little extra. Okay, so I'm going to go into my Sleek Makeup Palette and use it as a highlighter. I'm just going to take more of like the champagne shade and apply this with a small little highlighter brush all over. And lastly, let's move into lips. I'm going to take this NYX Liquid Suede Metallic Matte in the, the shade... <laughs> what is ACME? Okay, so it is called Acme. So that's, I don't know, that's a weird name. But it's just like a really pretty shimmery red shade. So let's go ahead and apply this all over. Me, you the shit. Okay, guys, here is the finished look. I absolutely love this Christmassy vibe. I love Christmas time. So we knew when I saw this palette, I knew that's what we had to do: is do a red green eye with some red lips. So I absolutely love this look. And as for the palette itself, I am going to give it a 10 out of 10. It is an amazing palette. The mirror is awesome. The shades are beautiful. They all blend to perfection. The pigment is bomb. I will, yeah, I can't wait to get the nice palette. You get to try that one out as well. But I absolutely love this palette. So if you have the chance to pick either of these ones up, please do so. And for last week's giveaway winner is... Congratulations, thank you so much for entering in and subscribing and tuning in. Go ahead and message me on Instagram at Michael Trey with three E's. And if you do not have one, that's totally okay. Um, go ahead and message me here on YouTube and we can get you your package. 
And for this week's giveaway, we have these two items right here. So first we have a BH Cosmetics Nude Lips 28 color lipstick palette with tons of beautiful shades, very light, getting really dark as well, so there's a lot of versatility in the look that you want to convey. And we also have the BH Cosmetics Eco Lux 10 piece brush set. Um, I really like the BH Cosmetics brushes, and this one is a really good one. It has some lip brushes in here, as well as obviously for the eyes, um, and a few face brushes as well. So if you want to win these two items, go ahead and do a normal like, subscribe, and leave a comment that you watched this video. Um, make sure your YouTube profile is on public, because if it is not, I will not be able to see you in the subscriber list, so then you won't be able to be entered. So just do those three simple things, and you will be entered into this week's giveaway. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this Kylie Jenner um, Naughty Palette Review slash tutorial with it. Like I said, it is a 10 out of 10, and I'm so excited that I purchased it. But thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will see you guys next week. Bye, guys.